Mr. Ross FM. You know who it is. Ross FM in the building. Of course, FatNet.com is in the building. Check it out. We at Resort World Casino. You know it's fly. They got their own water, kid. Anyway, we here for the big W Fet. And when I say this Fet is going to be crazy, we talking about the likes of Ravi B and Kama. We talking about Benjai. We talking about Patrice Roberts. Kerwin. You can't beat it. We are talking about Blacks. You can't beat it. Destro. It's going to be a crazy show tonight. It's your boy Sam Too Much back. Resort World Casino, man. Queens, New York. Labor Day Saturday. Listen. You see these two men right here? You see these two men right here? Elegant sound right here. They just came off stage. You're showing off, son. Crazy You're showing off, son. My DJ is doing his thing, right? You're showing off, son. I'm jealous. I'm a hater. Forget y'all, man. <laughs> Big up to my man, Babyface. My name Mega from Elegance, Brooklyn. Stand up, you already know. Big up to Super C, Hot Stepper, Father Roots, Babyface, Team Elegance. We head bad on the Monday, and we jump on Tuesday. You know we do it wet on the Wednesday, and then we Thursday, Thursday. We head on Friday by Friday. at the W Fet, and I'm telling you these three men here they just marched down the place believe me when I tell you we at Resort World Casino the W Fet. and first of all I want to introduce y'all to my man Sniper and the rest of the crew and they're gonna tell you about them and what they do Sniper Yo. what's up what's up it's your boy Sniper I'm the very hyper one you know what I mean <laughs> good night everybody how are they feeling how are they feeling good right now the party turn up it's Labor Day weekend. I out here to just do it crazy and wet. You know, I mean, as a power man, when I touch the stage, just mash up. It's turn up and twist up. Yes, That's how we just do it. You know, it's just about the music. It's just about the vibes. You know, I mean, I just want to big up the whole Attic Studio family. Everything is Attic production. You know, big up my boy Khan. You know, was on stage with me. You know, I mean, big up Song Lion, my DJ. Anywhere you go. Just about vibes. So, so for the people that don't know exactly who you are, tell them your big tune. Okay. We had our tunes, I could go way back when, you know what I mean? Back in Trinidad. I was part of the group Black Lyrics, part of Rituals label. Now I'm here doing it on my own, you know. And, you know, last year I had a tune with Scars. You know, I actually bring all the ass to rhythm with Yankee Boy, Scars, Lyrical, everybody on it, right? And we had a tune called Leave We Alone. We had bad on a Monday, and we drunk on Tuesday. We doing it wet on a Wednesday. Boy, we thirsty Thursday. We ain't done fry by Friday. Cause we just get we paid it. It's a no if, no maybe. Everybody hold on a lady and just leave we all alone, leave we alone. We dip on the streets and we not going home. Leave we all alone, leave we alone. This is why I want them to sing for me. I want them to sing a simple thing. All they're singing is la 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 You know, we did that. That was very nice. The ass rhythm was wonderful. You know, we did a very good job. This year I decided to go all powerful and it's out to bring out me in it because it had enough people in the business trying to keep me back. Right. And they can't really keep me back, you know, that's what I say. Can't stop me, try stop me now. Can't stop me, you mad at what? Can't stop me, try stop me now. What stop me, you mad at what? Somebody say the carnival hearts are done now. Somebody say we back and all hearts are done now. But the Brooklyn crew, they coming down. Arima crew, they coming down. The Bayesian crew, they coming down. The whole of Tobago coming down. Why? Because it's madness now and we don't give up. So when the sun come up, we there behind the truck, out on the road we had no behave. Chicks of me and bottle in the cool, come take a wine and burn down the haters, push them away if them try to stop you. Can't stop me, try to stop me now. And also in the house, we got the big man Khan in the house. 
Talk to the people. Let them know what you're all about, brother. Yeah, first thing I want to say. Mm, what is this? Ross FM? Of course. Respect the Ross FM. Got the Rastaman plan and the Rastaman foundation. See? Big up to everybody here. My name is Khan. Not Genghis Khan, not Sanna Khan, and not Kublai Khan. And not for sure, I'm not Imagan, but the original Rastaman Khan. See? Big up my boy, Sniper. Big up Sound Lion. We just mash it up there. Respect to everybody. Love the vibes, love the music. Just turn it up. We just turn it up. That's what it's. Right. Well, we appreciate y'all coming through, checking us out. Anytime you have anything brand new, we're going to play it on the radio because that's what we do because we definitely playing them tunes that you got, brother. It's the Midday Madness with Sam Too Much and Dandelion. Yo, and Ras FM Sniper. Now who say that? Who say that? Sniper says Give so. Him the big you know we crazy. Can't stop me, try stop me now. What stop me is madness now. Can't stop me, try stop me now. In Dandy Lion boy, you coming down is madness in the tongue. I want you to move. Well, this is your boy Khan, original Rasta man. Seen? I come to dedicate this one to Ras FM with my boy Dandy Lion and Sam too much. Listen and you shall learn to wisdom build it and house. I tell you that. Yeah, man, big up. All right, anyways, short time continues right here. Right now, we have a special treat for you guys. Come the more is in the back. Best strong cheese coming inside on the side. Want to be calm out there here. Yeah. We saw the CEO. I want to give it up right now for the Far East Club. Carnival flavor all the way from Japan. These two beautiful ladies right here that just came from off the stage, straight from Japan, mosh up the place. Trust me when I tell you. It's all about carnival flavor in the house. Introduce yourself, tell the people about you. So tell us about um, the music that you have. What, what, what type of music that, uh, what's, what's the name of the songs and all that stuff that you're doing now? Okay, so we did two songs. Right. The first song was called Soka Lovers. Mm -hmm. Second song was called Jump Up. And we were nominated for Best Soka uh, Music Video, Japan Music Video of the Year, and we won. All right, all right, because I see y'all have carnival and everything out there. I saw a couple of videos on YouTube. So a few thousand people chipping down the road. It was beautiful. Thank you very much, and we appreciate you coming through and hanging out with us. Thank you so much. And we wish you the best of success out here because soca music is for everybody. So if they say it's not for Japan, I have some filthy words, but we're not going to say the filthy words right now, but it's okay. All right? All right. Carnival flavor. This is Carnival flavor. We're with Ras FM. Peace out.
Ross FM, we back. The big W Fed Labor Day weekend, Saturday. I don't even have to say who this is. If you don't, no, no, because if they don't know, I'm going to pop them in their mouth. If they don't know who you are, I'm going to hit them in their mouth. <laughs> we got the one and only Mr. Curran Dubois in the building, man. Just shut down the place, did with anything, did his thing on stage. How you keep the energy up, man? How you do it? Show after show, how you do it? Well, I mean, it's the vibe of the people, you know, you know, I feed off our energies. So if you have energy, I suck some of yours and I continue to go. Right, so right. the more you give me, the more I give you. Right. All the time. So we know you make hit after hit after hit. We know that. How many more hits you got to come, man? And I know, well, it depends on, on you know, how much your father continue to bless me. Right. You know, so the more he bless me, the more I will continue to... But all good music and feel right, good music. Right. Yeah, yeah. Do you write for other artists also or just yourself? Yep. You name it, I write for them. Marshall Montano, Desha Garcia, Blacks, Fama Nappy, Patrice Roberts. You name it. It's a hard working brother right here. So what you got set up for the future? What you got coming up soon? Um, right now we're working on something to try and put soca music a little bit further out there, you know. Our music is big but it big amongst us amongst ourselves and right now my main aim is to try and fuse it as much as we could to get it out there to the others who are hungry for, for this. Right. You know, a lot of people might hear the word soca but they never experience soca right. and this kind of vibe. Right. So we want to try and take it to them. That's right. my next thing, just to go out there and take it to them. So when the world hears soca, they ah, hands up, flags, flags, rags, jump, jump. You understand what I'm saying? <laughs> Well, we just saw the, 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 the Japanese sister just get off. She did her thing. They're doing it down in Japan now. So it's a wonderful thing. Now, you had the big tune with Marshall Mantano this year. You had your own big tune this year. Who going to stop you, kid? Only the man who give it to me. He not going to stop you because he got to keep the good vibes flowing. And that's what it's all about. It's the one and only Mr. Kerwin Dubois. We just wanted to talk to him real quick because we know he's a busy man. But we appreciate you coming through the Ross FM. Yo! Get it right! <laughs> Yo, this is Kerwin Dubois right now. You're locked into the Midday Madness on Ross FM. Oh, bacchanal. Yeah. Labor Day Saturday. We're still here at the W Fed. Resort World Casino, Queens, New York. You know how it is. You see this man right here? If you ever been to Six Flags Great Adventure, Big Caribbean concert, Trini Fly Promotions right there. Every time we turn around, Ryan is somewhere. Talk to the people, for the people that's never experienced Six Flags. Tell them what it's about. Uh, it's, it's crazy, man. If they haven't been there, I don't know what people waited on, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Eight years strong, Six Flags, great adventure. Jackson, New Jersey, the biggest Six Flags in the whole of the United States. Biggest amusement park in the world right now because they um, joined the Wild Safari team. Right. So it's real epic. We do epic things, big things every year. Caribbean community come out in drums. They bring their family, the kids, right. many more. You was there this year, Tom? Of course, of course. Huh? I had a pretty good time. I had a good time. I jumped up, I said, what's up? Smacked a couple of people around, I'm lying. Anyway, my man Ryan, Trinity Fly Promotion. What's the sister that be rolling with you all the time? Latoya, Latoya. She always on point. That's one thing I say about them. If you need your info put out there, send it to Trinity Fly. Trust me, it's gonna get out there. Your fet gonna be big. How they get in touch with you? Oh, well, you can hit me at, you can log on to TrinityFlyPromotions.com, of course. Uh -huh. And then you can hit me up at 718 926-5975. Once again, 718-926-5975. Or you can hit us at the office at 212-222-8292. That's a whole lot of twos. You can't forget that one. That's a promoter, people. You hear that? And I say again, <laughs> that's a promoter. Big up to my man Ryan. Trinity Fly Promotions every time Ross FM. Hey, it's your surely Captain Jason Ben. We are, we are, we are on the boat and we having fun. So you don't know, artist, turn DJ, promoter, you know how I do it. The original cultural ambassador, you don't know. So um, it's a pleasure to be interviewed right now. You know, um, the vibe is very nice right now in the casino. It's my first time actually here. At the WFET? 
at the WFET. Oh, okay. It's my first time at the casino on the whole. Oh, okay. But I gotta say, enough respect to foreign base, enough respect to the management of um, the Maracas Club. And um, on my point right about now, I'm just tired. It's Labor Day weekend. I have a costume on the road, wow. on the parkway for Labor Day. Oh, and then with? I'm with Natural Freaks on the road. My uh -huh. section is completely sold out. Um, it was the number one. Section. It was the number one selling section for freaks. It's called Flame Flame Angel, sorry. Okay. And then I'm getting ready for Miami right after that. I got a boat ride in Miami called Shorts and Shades. Okay. Always sold out. And then I also got a section with freaks again in Miami called White Out. So I keep very very busy getting ready to head down to Trinidad. I have a brand new song with Babyface called Start the Jamming. That's um, Babyface out of Elegant Songs. Wicked, wicked tune, and um, you know, we're going looking forward to baby faces singing. Trust me, very talented artist. So, we join up together with a tune called Starty Jamming. Um, it's no time for texting, no Instagram or no tweeting. Forget the BBM in causes. Time to start the jamming. Hey, let me start the jamming. So, you don't know, look out for Trinidad Carnival 2014. So um, big up to Ross FM. Yes, sir. Thank you for interviewing me. It's a pleasure. You guys enjoy this show and keep looking at Ross FM. Anytime the day, it's sell out. You don't know. Boom. I'm not even gonna introduce this man. Just like I said earlier, I can't introduce him because everybody know him. If you don't, I'm gonna pop you in the mouth. You know how it is. <laughs> Mr. Ravi B himself, Mr. Karma himself, beautiful sister on the side, Nisha B is on the side. Gregory's on the side. You know how we do. You just got off the stage. You march down. You ain't even take the sweat off you yet, son. That's professionalism. Love the hairstyle. So I'm getting that. I'm getting that in a minute. Watch, watch, watch. So what's happening with you, bro? What's going on? Uh, that's happy right now, man. You know, um, we have been touring for a little while. Um, last week, Miami. This week, um, Labor Day Carnival. Right. Finally, after Labor Day Carnival, I'm getting a chance to go back home for about a week. Right. And uh, we had to travel again. So the hardest crazy. working man in show business, man. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> what what y'all got coming up new after, for, for 2014? What's going on with you? I mean, we have a lot of stuff happening. Uh, we were working with um, a lot of producers. I mean, next year, next year Carnival in Trinidad is a long carnival. So we had to start. I already finished two songs. Mm. And we still have a couple to do. We're trying to get our album done. Mm. As I said, because it's a long carnival next year. But it's really hard for us because the amount of events we have. So hopefully after Miami Carnival we get a little chance right. to really finish up everything that we have to finish up. You have, you have any um, other artists you're going to work with, do collaborations with, anything like that? Yeah, Anybody yeah. in mind? Yeah, we have a lot of people in mind. I don't really want to let anything out of the bag okay, yet. Okay. I don't like to say anything until it really happened, you know what I mean? Right, yeah. right, right, so, right. But a lot of great stuff coming up from Carmen, definitely for next year. Next okay. year is going to be great. Yeah. So how's everybody, man? How's the family? How's the rest of the band? How's everyone doing, man? Everybody's fantastic. Everybody's here. My whole team is here supporting me. Uh -huh. um, it's incredible. Just having a good time. We had to be, we went to Manhattan yesterday. Chill out. It was right. real cool, man. Right. Okay. So um, what's up with Chutney Monarch 2014, man? You're taking it away. What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> uh, you know, I, I just prefer to stay away from that for a little while. Uh -huh. If I feel the vibe right here, no problem. I'll enter back. But until that vibe get back right, I'll stay out for a while. Well, we voting for you. <laughs> so I think right. you need to get up in there. <laughs> well, a lot of people has a lot of people has been asking me when I coming back, right? Because they're waiting on Ravi B to come back. They're, they're saying that there's no competition without me. But hey, the, the, it was there before me. It will be there after me. And I just wanna I just wanna spread love with music. Music is not a competition for me. Yes, sir. It is not a competition. Yes, it's sir. a mission. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, we appreciate you coming through all the time. You always show us love. Ravi B, people. But oh, this is Ravi B, and you're listening to Midday Madness on Ras FM. Don't know. But oh, link up, permission on the road. It's a holiday on the road. Link up with the crew, start parade on the road. The sun gon' have to shine because we done rain on the road. Come, let me take a line. It's a holiday. A holiday. Sam too much back once again. We had the W Fed Labor Day weekend Saturday. I'm in love again. Finally, I got on camera. I'm gonna keep my hand back here because I don't want to get slapped. Anyway, we have the beautiful, the most talented. Personally, I call her the king of. I'm sorry, the queen of soca. That's who I call her. We have the one and only. Hey, I don't care who hear it. We have the beautiful one herself. Miss Patrice Roberts, how you doing? 
I'm fine, I'm blessed. It's always a pleasure to be here. Well, actually, being on stage and seeing the fans actually support me and giving me that love gives me more encouragement to go in the studio and do greater things, you know. I just don't want to be the same way every single year. I try to reinvent myself in terms of my hairstyle, my dress code, music. You know, music evolves every time, every year for me. So I'm really working hard and really working hard to give my fans what they want. Right, because every, every time we see you on stage, you give a thousand percent every time. Mm -hmm. We see what you do, and it's very nice to see that you're doing your own shows now, too. That's a beautiful thing. No, I'm serious. I think it's a beautiful thing, you know, you branching out on your own. I think that's wonderful. What you got for us for 2014? What's happening? 2014, I have, I mean, what you're seeing here is just uh, starting of what I'm about to do. When you see Patricia Roberts from in a few months to come, you'll be seeing a show with dancers and, you know, just kind of building my foundation. So this is just the starting of my, my a new beginning in my career. I'm not saying I'm not in the band, I'm still there. Right. But I'm, I'm also working hard as, on my solo act as well. So I'm a part of the band, but it's all about me. Well, I've been telling people for years and people can vouch for it. I say, yo, Patrice need to do her own thing every now and then. And now that you're doing it, you're going to make me cry, but I'm not. I'm going to hold myself, Patrice. I'm going to hold myself. I'm not going to cry today. But we appreciate you taking out time because I know you're a busy lady. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Hey, yo, this is your girl, Patrice Roberts. Right now, you're tuning to the Midday Madness on Ross FM, the number one station. Keep it locked. <laughs> it's all about Ross FM. Your boy Sam Too Much is in the building. Now, you see this man right here? There's a tune called Carnival Junkie. And to this day, it's still my favorite tune in the world. Remember that. And it's my honor and privilege to interview Mr. Blacks himself. How you doing, sir? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'm telling you, every time that tune come on, everybody move out my way because they know what's going to happen. All right. Tell they know what's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> so for the people that don't know you, just know your music. Can you tell me a little bit more about you, where you come from and all, how long you've been in the business? Well, I've been in the business real long. If I'm going to tell you the, um, the amount of years, you'll know my age. So, <laughs> <laughs> so in the business real long. Um, I've seen a lot of bands, Byron Lee, Atlantic, Blue Ventures. I'm now a member of Roy Cape All Stars. Yes, sir. People will know too much. Well, I think the whole world know me, but I'm a really low-key individual. Right. Um, I have five kids, so okay. majority of my time away from music is occupied by my five kids. Right. Last one, two and a half years old. So That's a beautiful know. thing. Congratulations. But 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 hold on. How you gonna be low key in the business, but you're gonna make a tune like Carnival Junkie? Come on, really? Well, um, I had a time God of my teeth for my teeth. Uh -huh. I mean, um, my success is not only based on myself, but based on a very good team that I have put together, from producers to financers to musical directors. So, I mean, and my life is, is an open book. Yes, sir. So there are certain elements that I keep for myself yeah. that, that, you know, that, that keeps me low key. You understand? So it's, it's all about love. It's all about living and, and living the right way. Right. Okay, now let, let's, talk, let's talk about the new tune, which is actually one of his favorites. <laughs> and Island Spice's favorite. Um, well, um, Let's talk about it. Lego was written by Ola Tunji. Okay. Right? That's a young and really fabulous artist in Trinidad. Mm. Uh, it was produced by Julio. That's the same guy who did um, Super Blue. Okay, okay, okay. And um, sung by me. What? It is just a good collaborated effort. You oh. know what I mean? A lot of. A lot of cooks came to the pot, uh -huh. and we came up with let go. Uh -huh. You know, and it, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, I gotta tell you, I'm digging. I just enjoying the ride. I gotta tell you, I'm digging the gazelles, my brother. I'm, I'm, I'm digging them. That's old school. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all know about those. I'm from the Bronx. I know about those. Believe me, we used to have the fake ones. I know about those with the rhinestones and everything. Right. But 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 back to this interview. <laughs> that was the fat boys. Y'all know about that. Anyway. So, so what you got coming up? What you got coming up for 2014, sir? Well, I can't tell you that. That could be letting the cat out of the bag. But definitely, we have songs like last year. I did 29 songs, so wow. we still have songs from 2013 right. that we will release to 2014. Right. I'm in the process of doing my reggae album. 
Um, oh, reggae album? Yeah, nice. and, and, and on the down low right now because Caravan is here again. Yes, sir. So I'm hoping that I could, you know, after Caravan, I could work on, on, on bringing forward that reggae album because I'm not only a soak artist, right. I'm a singer, man. I'm a real singer, man. I'm, I'm a one of the few singers we have in Trinidad and Tobago. Not just soak artists. Right. You know, so it's just work in progress, hard work. And again, I want to thank my team. Yes, sir. Well, we're not going to take up too much more of your time, but we appreciate you having this interview. Like I said, Carnival Junkie, man. You did it. I'm proud of you. <laughs> you know what the sense is. Uh, come on, man. <laughs> That's what it's all about. We appreciate you coming through. And okay. anytime you have any music, I'm going to give you my card because we need all that new music, man. All right, okay. Every time. Well, then give me your email, so as fast as I release, uh, I will send them to you. No doubt, I no do. doubt. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Mr. Black. I want a girl who could whine all day. Give it how I want it and make me feel a pain now. Hey, yo, this is Blacks, and this is the Midday Madness on Ross FM. Black says so. Spread your hands and let go. Love you. Respect. We have the one and only right here live at the W Fed. It's the queen of Bacchanal and the queen of everything else, I would say. The queen of. I don't know. I just know I cost half a everywhere. <laughs> we have the wonderful, the beautiful Miss Destra Garcia in the house. How you doing? I'm great. Blessed. I can't complain, so I'm not going to say nothing negative. You just came off stage and killed the place. I mean, there's nothing, there's nothing to say. I mean, it the proof is in the pudding. It was all right. It was all right. <laughs> she modest, she modest, she modest. So what we got going on for 2014? We, you killed it in 2013. What's going on for 2014? Well, I aim to be better. I always try to think about my fans first and what they would like to see. Yes. I'm trying right now to kind of revamp my image. That's why I took off the weave and I just kind of cut my hair because I'm in between. So I don't know where I'm going. I did, I did the same thing. Yeah, I know. Yeah, Welcome I did the same to the club. Thing. That's what Welcome I did. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I don't know where I'm going yet. Uh -huh. But I'm I'm creating right now. I'm trying, you know, I'm I'm at home making sure that I'm, you know, ready for right. carnival. I stopped touring. This is my last show until three weeks. So okay. I have a three week break. So I'm, I'm gonna get to record, I'm gonna get to think, I'm gonna get to plan. So that's what's up right now. But 2014, trust me guys, I'm always thinking about you, so it's gonna be awesome. It's all about Miss Destra Garcia. New style, no weave, 2014, three weeks off. What can you do? Ross FM, bitches. <laughs> This is Destra, and it's all about the make them madness on Ross FM. And they can't get mad if I'm not in the place to make it mad. You hear me? www.rossfm.com. Blazing reggae and soca, and home to the midday madness.